In this video, we're going to learn about the US Automatic 7-Day Timer. I will show you what each connector is, how to set up the time and clock, how to set the activation time, how to set up the deactivation time, and how to set the days of the week. The wires are not included with this product. There are three connectors that are labeled by numbers. The one input is the positive 12 volt, the two input is the negative zero volt, the four input is the normally open relay. Press and hold the clock key. While holding the clock key down, press the day to change which day of the week you want it to set to. Then press the hour key to change the hour of the day. Next, press the min key to change the minutes of the hour. Since the timer does use a 24 hour format, for example, if you need to set the time to 7 a.m. and want it to close at 7 p.m., it will actually be 1900 for the close time. Press the timer key. The LCD screen will show one on. This is for the time you want the gate to open. Press the day key to select any of the 15 day combinations of the daily programs to the days you want the timer to be active. Press the hour and min key to select the time you want the gate to open. For this demonstration, we'll set the timer to 110 for our one on time. After you finish setting your one on, press timer key again and one off will appear. Press the timer key. The LCD screen will show one off. This is the time you want the gate to close. Press the day key to select any of the 15 day combinations for the daily programs to the days you want the timer to be active. Press the hour and min key to select the time you want the gate to close. For demonstration, we'll set the timer to 111 for our one off time. After you finish setting your one off, press the clock key and the timer will take you to the home screen. The timer does not activate the gate to close. It simply turns off, allowing the auto-close timer on the main control board to count down and activate the gate to close.